Five years after their health and pension cuts were cut, Memphis police and firefighters are hoping to get their benefits back, but you'll have to vote for it. Now, after receiving more than 140,000 signatures on petitions, the groups are ready to see if you are willing to vote for a sales tax increase in order that they get benefits restored. Local 24 News reporter Mike Matthews is talking about your money. It has been a controversial idea, and the whole thing created controversy in 2014 when the cuts first came down. Now, they're taking action. The boxes speak. They carry more than 140,000 names of people who want to vote to decide whether to raise the sales tax in Memphis by half a cent. The money raised would go to education and to fix up roads and something else. We don't want to make this an us against Mayor Strickland deal. Uh, we've went out, we've gotten the signatures. Now we just want to put it to the citizens those that are being affected by the high crime in this city. Mike Williams of the Memphis Police Association and Mayor Jim Strickland don't go to cookouts together. Williams ran against Strickland for mayor four years ago, came in third place. This time he wants to make it clear what's happening here has nothing to do with Williams running for mayor again. I am not running for mayor of the city of Memphis. Raising the Memphis sales tax by half a cent would make it equal to the sales taxes in the other Shelby County municipalities. Several years ago, 60% of voters shot down a plan to raise the sales tax, with the money then going to pre-kindergarten programs. In this case, the unions say taxpayers would end up saving money by keeping officers and firefighters in Memphis. They continue to leave, says Thomas Malone of the Firefighters Association. We will admit that it, the, the recruiting in this city is fine. You know why? Because once you come and work three, four years in this city as a fire or police officer, you can go anywhere in the country and get a job. You've got more experience than anywhere in the country. Mayor Jim Strickland says if people want to raise their own taxes, it's up to them. He says recruiting gains continue, and they are keeping more officers and firefighters on the job. The group is saying they're not fighting Jim Strickland. This will not be a personal battle against the mayor or members of city council. They're just bringing it to you. In Memphis, Mike Matthews, Local 24 News.